When we develop granules, we look at different aspects. We want it to have a good hardness so it doesn't fall apart during the transportation or the loading of the, of the apparatus. To be sure that the farmer have a, has an even spread of the granules over his field, uh, it's not enough to just test the hardness. We have to mix the right granule sizes so that they spread evenly. And to be really sure that this happens as we wish, we test it actually in the spreaders that the farmers use in the field. And on the other hand, when it's on the field, we want it to dissolve with rain in a proper way, fast and efficient. So the rain table is a rain simulator that enables us to distribute the pots of a trial under the rain table and having them irrigated by a rain simulation every day while growing under the artificial lights. For this integration, I have uh, made a smaller version of the rain table where we put a certain amount of granules on a permeable film and uh, we put a certain amount of rain on it to measure what remains and have a percentage of this integration afterwards. The rain rack is a device we use to test the leaching of products through soil and we spray water on the surface over a long period of time to simulate a season's rainfall. We then collect the water that comes underneath it and measure the nutrients that we can detect in it. For the fog pots is a technique to nourish the plants with fog. The nutrients are in the fog and we use that to demonstrate the difference in growth when you have a different pH, suboptimal and an optimal one while using the same nutrient amount in each pot, you can observe an improved growth. The Rhizotron is another technique to observe root growth. We can test the efficacy of a granule's ability to correct pH by adding it to an acidic solution and measuring the pH before and after. We have this technical center here to test our products and to develop new products. We also test uh, alterations in our existing recipes and we also answer questions from our customers.